on the board, we have 2.3 times 0.4. When we multiply decimals, we're going to work out the problem first and then add our decimal at the end. We're going to start in the ones column, take our 3, multiply it by 4 to get 12. We put down our 2, which represents the ones. We carry the 1, which represents the tens. We multiply 2 times 4 to get 8. Add our 1, this gives us 9. Now what we want to do is move the decimal in our answer the same amount of places as it's moved in our problem. In our problem, we have two decimals. One in the first digit, one in the second digit. In the first digit, the decimal is moved one place to the left. In our second digit, the decimal is also moved one place to the left. That makes two places total. So in our answer, we want to move the decimal two places to the left. We start at the extreme right, move our decimal two places to the left, and we have a final answer of 0.92. Don't forget that to the right of every whole number is a decimal. Sometimes it's invisible and we don't use it, other times we do use it. So when we're moving our decimal and our answer, we're going to start at the right of the ones column where we have our decimal. We move it two places to the left to get our final answer of 0.92.